Welcome back to another Bargain Savage video and today I have for you this LED music bulb from Wish. Now let's see what it's all about. Okay, so I ordered this music bulb off Wish a while ago and it cost me $9.60 plus $7 shipping. So that's sixteen sixty. Uh, on the front of the box here, it's got a few different configurations of the bulbs that you can order. Uh, this is the one here that I ordered. Uh, on the description, it said 12 watt wireless E27 RGB Bluetooth LED stereo audio speaker, plus a bunch of other stuff. On the box here, it just says LED music bulb. It has some specifications on the top here uh, it's supposed to be 12 watt it says LED power is 4 to 7 watts uh, power is 4 to 12 watts voltage is 100 to 240 the speaker output is 3 watts it has a frequency response of 135 Hertz to 15 kilohertz wireless version 4.0 and a radio range of 10 meters so let's see what we got in here. Got a remote. And the bulb, and that's it. No instructions. So you can see the speaker in the end there. And it looks like a big bulb. So uh, let's see if we can get this thing hooked up. We got a little lamp here. And I will plug it in. Okay. Whoa. Well, the ball part works. Let's get the remote out here. Little tab, text the battery. Let's see if it shuts off. Hey, there we go. On. Red. Green. Blue. And some different shades. Yellow. Orange. Different color blue. Well, that all seems to be working. White. Mm, not getting any white. This is a better picture of the colors. The remote is pretty cheap. But it's like any generic light remote that I've got. See, it says flash. Okay, it's going to cycle through some colors there. Strobe. More of a fade. But this here is fade. And smooth. Oh yeah. That's smooth. For some reason I can't get plain old white to work. It's also a dimmer. Let's go with red. And try and dim it down. There we go. It's going the wrong way. So it looks like three different settings. I don't know if you can pick that up on camera very good. 
three different brightness settings. I can't get white to work. Change the color, turn it off. When you turn it back on, it looks like it turns back to the same color that you had it set on. So go to yellow and off, back on, yellow, red, off, turn it back on, it's red again. So it seems like the only thing that's not working on there is to get it just to be plain old white. All right, let's see if we can get this hooked up to some music. Had to wait for my phone to turn on. Oh, let's see if we can find it. Bluetooth. Scan. Okay, this must be it. I got JKS.ZSY-RGB. And it's paired. That was quick. Okay, and I'll go to my great old test track. See what it sounds like. Okay, when I hit the volume down, it uh, stopped it. But it still says it's connected. Okay, the skip track is working. Okay, the volume works. You have to hold the button. Thank uh -huh. 
out of that. I think it works fairly well. The only thing that it doesn't do that is uh, kind of odd is that it has a button for white and uh, it will not turn white which is weird too because on the top of the box it actually says LED light color white or warm white and uh, there is no white here at all. Uh, second thing would be that the volume buttons have no indication of max volume. Usually these things give you a beep when, to let you know that you're at all the way up or all the way down. Yeah. I think I, think I could recommend this. Okay, I gave it a quick decibel rating and from 10 centimeters away, it was 99.9, .9, and from point, ba point blank range, I got 127.4. So that's probably one of the loudest ones we've reviewed yet, so not bad. It is fairly loud, and it sounds not too bad for 14 bucks. It's, uh, I guess, 16.60. It's a pretty cool little gadget. When I looked up on the website again on Wish, it uh, had these on a little bit higher price than what it was before. Uh, with outer remote and a 5 watt bulb was $14 and a 5 watt with remote was $15 plus shipping and a 12 volt or 12 watt with remote was $24 plus shipping. So that'd be over 30 bucks now for this. I think you can wait for them to go on sale uh, or find it from a different supplier. And I'm going to screw this into the ceiling. And Okay, now, when I got this, my wife said it was stupid, so I put it over top of the sink here. I don't think she's going to think it's stupid now. And especially when I can make it think. running for about 20 minutes now and uh, it's just kind of warm it's not hot by any means it's actually barely even warm I don't think that'll cause a problem Now one thing I forgot to try was will the speaker keep playing when you shut the light off? And the answer is, yep. Now remember, smash that like button and hit subscribe if you already haven't. And if you got time, we'll watch another video. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.